Barnes. Now, there's the kick into the corner, but the bounce is going to be OK for Whitelock. And across it goes to Dag. And, well, they love to counter-attack, but this time, Guilford needs support. He finds Fruin, who did well to get back there in support. And Fruin gets the fend going. <sighs> Keeps it on the toe. Adam Ashley Cooper with 15 on his back, pull down, and the Crusaders pour in. Crusaders immediately to turn this counter-attacking opportunity through Robbie Fruin. There you can see him dancing the sideline, and a beautiful, beautiful little kick off the outside of the boots. A little confusion there, Adam Ashley Cooper caught. And then it's the forward pack of the Crusaders who pour in. You can see their body height there down nice and low, the little hand, possibly from Dave Dennis, was it in the end? And Ace back in. Well, here they go again, the Crusaders. This time, the double round with Ellis and... Oh, brilliant take from Fruin! Fruin! Robbie Fruin! What a try! Whoa! That is wide hot. He could have gone to the right, stepped back and under the post. Flat one, and then he took off. But we'll see how, how flat it was. Yeah, There's super Ellis. Flat. Comes round behind Taylor. Goes the dummy, sucks in defenders, looks all right to Fruin, but it's that charge there. Everyone figured he was going wide because he had two uh, support players. Did it all himself. Well, it was a magnificent ball. At first thought, I thought that's a forward pass there, but no, nah, it was right dead on line. Robbie Fruin ran a beautiful line. Big step off the right foot back in. He's looking more like Mr. T every moment. Oh, Dizzy. Dizzy. Oh. Oh. Ellis Taylor. Dag up from fullback, bit of a shimmy, and now Fruin. Fruin dummying. Fruin! Oh, brilliant! Absolutely brilliant. He is carving them up on the outside, Robbie Fruin. A wonderful support play on the inside. Try to the Crusaders. Extraordinary skill. And it was rifled out there as well. There was some Waratah forwards out there. You can see the two front rowers and then the back lines here. Tommy Carter couldn't quite catch him. Beric Barnes picked up the last one and well it was Zach Guilford that was able to catch that. In the same way that Adam Ashley Cooper got on the outside of Fruin. Fruin's done it to Tom Carter. It's hard to chase from there. Zach Guilford chasing through thinking oh I wish I got it earlier but it didn't matter because he only had five metres to run. Tell you what, it's a pretty good tackle too by Beric Barnes in that last line of defence. To hit that dynamo. We've got the three-time IRB, International Rugby Board Player of the Year, on the bench. Richie McCourt, Taylor, now Fruin. Tried to crash over Tom Carter. Pines to Franks. Reed wide to Fruin. Dag up from fullback, looking promising. Guilford. Got it to Fruin. Oh. Unbelievable, Robbie Fruin. He had no room to move whatsoever down the short side, and he has nailed it again. Robbie Fruin, he got a double last year against the Waratahs in Nelson, and now he's got a double at Allianz Stadium. Oh. Dag, then you got Dag, they're three main strike players. After that's happened, you've got Fruin, Guilford, and Dag here. Gives it to Guilford, and then Fruin again. They have all season been their main strike players. Oh, Tom Carter, that's a bad miss. Right as he only had an inch to spare, Fruin, and he managed to scramble through it. Yeah, I mean, it's just brilliant play from Fruin, just backing up just leaving his run till late he came around from depth saw there was some space on the outside and away you go i mean the waratahs you could be forgiven for thinking oh no one can sneak down there there's no room again what you talk about robbie fruin oh, what a performance from him oh master class on outside running well that was this one and the chip kick there was some wonderful stuff he showed this afternoon this is the inside run. Everyone thought he'd go to the uh, right-hand side. He went bang off the right and under the post. He could have used supporters, but didn't need them. This time he had Guilford. Took the tackle of Beric Barnes out the back door, and that was their second try. Scores the first, sets up the second, and then scores the third. What an afternoon out. There was some weak tackling. And I reckon that Tom Carter might have nightmares about uh, having... To watch some of that vision, he Robbie Fruin, lethal. Oh, I mean, well. I